Welcome to Excel Tips and tip number 46. In this tip we're going to show you how to get the file name, uh, sorry, the sheet name through using a formula to display on your sheet. Now one of the important things to note before you do this is you'll need to actually save the workbook so if you haven't saved the workbook to your desktop or whatnot um, this won't work, it will just show hash value. So the formula is actually pretty simple, it looks long and complex but it's pretty simple. The mid uh, formula says what's the text, so we actually say um, cell file name A1, which gives you, if I just press F9, gives you the address of where I've saved the uh, the book and um, test. Um, we then say find uh, the right square bracket within that name and then add one. This will give us our starting location, so you'll see it's 53 um, and you'll see that says start number. If I then highlight the next section, this is basically saying find the length of that full name, so it's going to be 56. So you've said, right, we're going to start at the 53rd um, character. It's 56 long, and then we've gone, right, well, how long is um, it up to just that square bracket, which is this next section, which is going to be 52 cells. So when we solve that, it's going to say, this is the text, this is the starting position, and this is the number of characters. So essentially, it's going to start and return test. Um, if I just hit escape and paste that back in, you see it's got test. Now, A1 can be anywhere in the sheet. As I said, file name, just make, need to make sure that the file's been um, saved and uh, everything will be good to go. And you can automatically put um, the sheet name into your header or use it.